Hello everyone, welcome to another, I'm not going to say two minutes because what I'm going to say is going to take a little longer than two minutes. Maybe a little crazy, maybe a little silly, probably a lot of blabbering, but this is a very unfortunate topic that is my vlog. Today, the comic and film world have lost a legend. Stanley passed away today at the age of 95. Stanley has provided great entertainment over the past 70 plus years of his life. He is the man behind the Marvel name. When I heard this this evening when I got home, it hurts. I was fortunate enough to briefly see him 2014 at the London Film Comic Convention for Showmasters while I was working alongside Impact Wrestling at a press pass with my brother where he managed to jump the queue that was tailing around the building I lined up picked the 8x10 I wanted got the authentication sticker it's about, about the size of a 10 pence piece UK 10 pence piece and he signed left handed Stanley but the process he was going through was like a conveyor belt it was just sign next bit paper sign next comic sign next picture sign moving on and he didn't look up once even though I jumped the queue, there was like the gold members who purchased like tons of money to get like to see Stanley before anybody else. And everybody was just you're not allowed to touch him because they're afraid that if you shake his hand, you'll break his hand, or you'll bruise him so he won't be able to sign, etc. And it's Cavalier that says to just sign after sign after sign. And nobody was saying anything to him and I thought, sorry, I'm going to have to say something. And I said, thank you, sir. I said, thank you, sir. Just to break what he was doing, just for a second. And he looked up, wondered who it was, saw me, and he mumbled, you're welcome. And then the gentleman behind him was telling him to sign everything. He tapped on the shoulder and pointed down. Back to the signing. Back to the signing, he went. I thought Stanley was going to live to it easily as hundreds. I know he had illnesses leading up to to now but I really wanted him to lift Force Hammer in the scene where he's cleaning up like one of his many cameos just for him to pick up the hammer just to give the table a quick wipe underneath to put it down and just the, that pot would have been brilliant. I'm not sure what other cameos he'll have now because I apparently heard that they filmed a load of cameos for him to appear in for future Marvel films. But my best, the best cameo for me, I think, I think his best cameo appearance was when he was in Spider-Man. Yeah, his best cameo was in Spider-Man. When he had headphones in and the music playing in the background, there's stuff flying everywhere and he's oblivious to it all. Absolutely oblivious. That made me chuckle a lot. Stanley, wherever you are, thank you for providing 70 plus years of, of service. Give our best to Bill Bixby. And I hope that the rest of the Marvel films that come out will make you proud. Rest in peace, Stanley.